All right, guys, we're back again. Today I wanted to show you guys how to set up teleport. Teleport is awesome, uh, works great on my phone. Uh, they're gonna have it for computers eventually. We connect your big computers, but for now it's just mobile devices. So let's get right into that. But before we do, run that intro. All right, guys, so today I'm gonna be showing you some things about teleport. So first of all, you go to your VPN information, VPN and teleport, since it just came out on the UDM and the UDM Pro, the SE and UDR have had it for a little bit, but I haven't had a chance to play with it, but I have now, and it's cool. So I wanted to give you guys some intro on it, so let's get into it. So first, when you're here, make sure you have teleport enabled. You know, you got to enable it for it to work. So you can go to generate link. So generate a link. This link expires in 24 hours. And so they have to accept it before the 24 hours. Or if you're like, hey, you know what, I shouldn't have sent that link, whatever, to I'll cancel it. You can revoke it down here. That's the way to do it there. The next is you guys can go to your devices and you can see my phone is offline. I have I think I have displayed offline. Let's see. Yeah, well, I was connected to it recently. That's why it's on. I'm not connected to it now. I'll check my phone right now. It's off. Yep, it's off. That's why there's no data going through it or anything like that. But you can click on the user and click revoke. It depends on if they, how recently they've gone on it. If you haven't gone in a couple of weeks, you won't be able to see their name, their, you know, their, their device there to revoke it so they can't come back again. They were supposed to be fixing this with an update, I think, I heard. Uh, but we'll wait to see it. We don't know how long that'll be. But I would just say just use it for yourself in general for now or your IT admin or something like that if they want to be able to do it on their phone. Uh, I don't even know for IT admin yet. I don't think so. In case you fire them for some reason, then why would you want them access to your stuff? So I would say teleport right now, not for office yet because, you know, they have Unify Access and all that other kind of cool stuff and UI and all that. And I would say that would be more for the business part. I would say the teleport is basically just for home users, admins and family on the home, main family and the home user. That's what I would say. That's exactly what I would say. So when you're out somewhere and you want to connect to your, on your mobile phone, you can connect your back to your network or check your stuff. I mean, or you use your pie hole on the go if you want to, which is cool. That's the way I would say to do it. But all right. So yeah, you can just click the name of this is the, my phone, the teleport, that's the little teleport logo they have for it. And you can just click revoke or disconnect. Next, what I wanna show you is, I wanna show you guys how to do it on your phone. So let's get right into that. All right guys, so once you would generate the code, this is the way I would do it. I would do it on the phone more than the actual computer itself. And I have, I'm logged into my uh, router right now and uh from unify.ui.com and uh or i mean if you're on your home network just type in an ip address but when you generate your link you can just copy it and now when you go to the app this is my phone right here already i'm hiding my ip address don't want to get you know people hacking my stuff but um when you click the little tab i can add multiple ones so i can add a new tunnel I can just click, hold, let go, and paste that link and hit connect right there. So I think it's a lot easier because that link, if it's on your computer, how are you supposed to get it on your phone unless you email it to yourself? That's just, that's just annoying. I'm sorry. I don't want to have to do that. So that's why I did it like that. I just thought that was way easier for you guys. But you can add multiple tunnels too. So that is freaking awesome. All right, guys. Let's get back right into it. All right, guys. So that was Teleport VPN. Um, the, well, I wouldn't say, it's just Teleport, sorry to say. I mean, I get too excited here for a minute, but yeah, I love it. I love being able to access it easier. It was kind of a, a pain in the butt to set up a VPN on my Android phone before, and now with Teleport, it just makes it snappy and easy peasy. It's easy peasy, let's just say that. Um, but yeah. It literally uh, works great. Check my Pi hole, be able to check my network. I mean, I was able to check it before, but I had to my Raspberry Pi if I wanted to edit some stuff. Now I don't have to do that remote login from there. I can just do it from my phone, and it's just really cool. I can't wait till they add the features. I mean, 
once they add this where they can have groups and you can see people that you've allowed and teleport once they have that feature then it can be for everyone then you can literally give it to anyone you want and be able to revoke their access anytime that's all they need to add that's all they need to add just all they need to add like like a phone book of people that they've allowed and you can revoke their access that's all you need to get and once they have that then it, it's for the masses it really is but for now i would say it's just for people that are at home uh, home users that want to connect to their router and then the main family members those are the only people I could say that would use it right now otherwise they have all the other suites and stuff that you can use um, UI and all that stuff that they have uh, and all that that's the only thing I would say to be able to use uh, VPN protocol other than that I would say just wait on it or you can just use the LTTP for the I mean for the that's uh, L2TP for the uh, your computers that's always you know I can add multiple people for that and always delete them off it so that works we just need that same deleting the access users that you allowed off for teleport but hey I hope you guys like these videos like comment subscribe definitely helps you when you hit that subscribe button helps me a lot the most important thing is you guys are having a rock and rolling day stay cool in this hot summer right now and I'll see you guys in the next video.